Every year, I like to have my husband drag me around in the trailer behind the truck so I can listen for anything that's gotten loose, needs adjusted, how loud it is back here, if there's any issues. <laughs> so, um, he thinks I'm a dork. He was just calling me names and laughing at me, but I think it's really important to do this. So, I highly suggest everyone do it. And I will take you along for the ride. You'll get to hear how loud it is in the trailer. And also, my husband's a crazy driver. <laughs> I think he's trying to make me fall. So, number one, the door is really loud. But, I'm going to be replacing these double doors with one single big door. Hopefully, soon. Um, look at that. That hinge is broken on the bottom. I do know that. Luckily, the minis don't can't go all the way back to the doors. These will typically rattle, but we have reinforced them with a million screws. So they're pretty quiet right now. Um, I've taken out everything that used to rattle. There was a piece of metal here. Um, which, of course, if you had big horses and they fought, you know, the metal would keep them from looking at each other. But it was so loud. That thing would just rattle and rattle, and that was right by their ears. I actually took that out when I had Billy and Chloe, and I just made a net that I put here, and they did fine. So I highly recommend having bars welded if you need that divider. Or like in your slant load trailers, they'll often have that piece of sheet metal like you know thin metal and it just vibrates horribly on those dividers so I would suggest having metal bars welded in place instead of those sheet metal dividers take a look out <laughs> these are the roads get on some rougher roads in a second. That door though is going to be really rattling. I'll have to put something on that door. So the ceiling is rattling right here. You hear that? Woo! Here we go. We're in some rough stuff. stripping for the door and that's going to quiet it down quite a bit. the drive last weekend the road we drove on was so rough oh my gosh and I all I could think about was oh, I wonder how loud it is in the trailer so this door must have been about making sky loser mine and the ceiling I usually have my hubby drive me before we go anywhere but I wasn't able to do that this year <laughs> so well if I'm holding the door you can hear how quiet it is not that bad. And the roads are wet because we've been getting snow and rain the last two days, so not too dusty. That's good. For my old ugly trailer, it's a pretty tight little rig. We've really, we've, it, it's got so many sheet screws in it holding things together. <laughs> we put tons of sheet screws in there. Um, it was riveted and then we added a bunch of sheet screws to try to hold things down that were rattly. 
So I think we did a good job. Here's some washboards. It's not too bad. I think you'll be surprised if you do this in your trailer how loud it might be because we've really reinforced this one a lot. So I highly suggest everyone do this. Just take, have your husband or a trusted person take you around on a little country road and see how your trailer sounds.